What's up, you money makers? Welcome back to the channel. Are you looking for your next 10x play into the OTC or penny stock market? Are you looking for a company that can get $1,000 into $10,000 return on your investment? Let's watch. I'm going to share in next few minutes why this stock can move 10x. It can be a great 10x play. Why there is a massive potential and big catalysts coming up for this particular stock. Hit that like button if you like this video. Welcome back cyberlux family and cyberlux army let's look into why cyberlux can turn into tanx from this price point i want you to pay an attention right here at two cents the price point the current price point i want you to also pay an attention to the market cap of 123.3 million as you see at the moment we are in the red days the market have, has ups and downs the otc and penny stock market is not doing so great lately and it's sideways for last few days and that's where i call a great opportunity of buying because red days gives you red days give you an opportunity to buy more and more at a discounted price the valuation of the company does not change uh, the intrinsic value of the company does not really change. The fundamentals of the company doesn't change. What changes is the sentiment in the market. If you take a look at penny stocks, if you look at OTC stocks, if you look at crypto market, I have been covering a ton. I covered precisely VET, VeChain, uh, VAT token. I covered Polygon. They have been doing extraordinary well. And I'm telling you, CYBL, ticker symbol CYBL, OTC play is going to do the same. The two cent stock can turn into 20 cent stock once again take a look at the market cap by the way if you haven't clicked the like button hit that like button so we can share this video with more and more people i really want to make sure that my research analysis and review reaches to more and more people so hit that like button subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you can get notified every single time i post the video which is super super time sensitive and it can earn you hundreds of dollars by the way i'm not really financial advisor so do your own due diligence and research this is only for the entertainment purposes but i like to share my view opinion and thoughts with you hoping you can make informed financial decision now without further delay let me tell you why i'm calling this stock a 10x play why i'm calling this company a hundred million dollar revenue company and why i believe in the company i by the way for full disclaimer i i, I am invested in cybl and i have been covering it brought this stock over to you when it used to be one cent between one to two cents and multiple times we talked about it and I'm writing it for free and I hope you can also write for free there is going to be such a massive wave in my opinion based on what the company is up to let's talk about it the company wants to become a hundred million dollar revenue company and I do see that there is a silver lining at the end of the tunnel and this is going to be super super impressive let's talk about what the company is telling us at the moment the company has uh, increased their revenue guidance uh, very very soon uh, in 2022 they are revised guidance they have the revised guidance for 2022 up to 47 percent spike in 2021 the revised revenue guidance was 27 up and they hit it they are going to hit it by the way november 2021 revenue estimate they beat by 37 percent what that means is company over exceeded their own expectations that they did not realize that they're going to hit 37 percent high in terms of the revenue october revenue estimate they beat by almost 2x so 92 percent they beat the revenue estimate by 92 percent q3 2021 revenue they beat by 613 percent from q2 revenue and they beat, beat their estimate by 50 percent so this is how aggressively they're moving forward with the revenue goals and i'll quickly share with you further updates but before that i just also wanted to tell you that this company was a new company they joined twitter on 2021 they have a very strong community 9137 followers as you see at the moment there are plenty of uh, visibility into the marketplace this is an otc play not every player can buy because of the otc limitations not every brokerage or platform support otc play so you gotta have the platform or brokerage firm that supports this particular cybl otc play and any other play that you're playing in the otc market let's get into more detail here is the announcement that just came out today take a look cyberlux corporation raises its revenue guidance by of 2022 by 47 percent for the full year and i truly believe because i have been following this company along the way we have seen ups and downs let's take a look right here the stock went to six 
and a half cent so right here as you can see it went to 6.5 cents from one cent and one thousand dollars if someone has invested turned into six thousand five hundred dollars right here because it has it had a massive run up we went down and we are now back to two cents which is when i call a massive buying opportunity now take a look what the company is uh, telling us this technology platform company leading digital transformation across the industry's advanced unmanned aircraft us solution led lighting solution renewable energy and infrastructure technology and infrastructure software as a service which is says announced the company that it is increasing the revenue guidance for the full year of 2022 by from 30 million dollars to 44.8 million dollars now this is just in 2022 remember what i talked about this revenue model that they want to become a hundred million dollar revenue company and this is not for 10 year goal 15 year goal not like that we are talking within next couple of years this company is going to hit a hundred million dollar in revenue the company that had less than 2.5 million dollar in revenue started exceeding the revenue goals by multiple double digit uh, double digit percentage as you see right here quarter over quarter month over month they are expecting 45 million almost 45 million 44.8 million dollars in revenue from 30.5 five million dollar revenue guidance now if you take a look once again that's why i told you to take a look at the market cap do you believe that 143 million dollar market cap can turn into 1.4 billion you ask yourself yes or no i'm not a financial advisor but if you believe that if the company can hit 10x in terms of the revenue can the market cap be 10x as well can it gain 10x as well i believe it's totally possible and that's why i'm saying if the market cap hits 10x we are looking at 20 20 cents from two cents and which is where i'm coming from so it's a really really mathematical calculation that i'm putting into place now this is risk versus reward so anything can happen so do your own due diligence don't invest a ton of money don't invest the money especially that you cannot you that wakes you up at night and you cannot cannot lose so just invest the money that you can you're willing to lose and that can turn into 10x great great deal now if you write for free even better which means you don't really have your own money out of your own pocket um so you can hit that like button subscribe to my channel if you want to help support this channel you can join the patreon group you have direct access to a small group of people who are enthusiastic about penny stocks cryptocurrency and you can directly talk to me as well via the patreon and uh, private uh, discord that we have but for 2022 this revenue goal is uh, spiked up from or, or increased by the company itself from 30.5 million to 44.8 million dollars which is a 47 percent increase from company's prior guidance in addition the company is expecting to post significant positive growth in net income from operations for the full year of 2022 which means they're going to bring in bring home more money for themselves for their investors and for their shareholders so don't miss out on that dear cy bill community we are beyond excited that our 2022 revenue guidance for full year from third we are raising or excited to raise our 2022 revenue guidance from uh, for the full year from 30.5 million to 44.8 million an increase of 14.3 million dollars up from 47 percent from the prior estimate as provided in our recent investor relation presentation during the last six months we have been working with our channel partners our industry partners and key customer across our four business units and i will Talk, talk, I'll tell you this four business units and how they have divided. They had divided back in the days the 30.5 million estimate. Flydie unmanned U, uh, aircraft uh, system UAS, advanced lighting system, infrastructure technology solutions, which is ITS, and infrastructure software solutions to target the highest impact and most scalable opportunity. Last week, we were able to confirm 2022 guidance with the contract opportunity pipeline we have in front of us. This is remarkable time for the company as well as we, what we saw in October and November in revenue result and su subsequent revision of 2021 full year of guidance we are fully we have fully begun to transformation of cybl into an advanced technology platform company participating with our ongoing strategic intellectual property development efforts they expect the business for 2022 will far exceed their own expectations over 14 million us dollars in revenue across all the business units especially driven by the newly emerging its or infrastructure technology software solution group and we will have more to say in sas group as well 
in the upcoming days, but we are truly harnessing the future with the, uh, all of their business units. We are literally only six months into the company transformation with the launch of Operation Alpha. Revenue growth is almost 50% higher than what they Im initially imagined for 2022, and we are very well positioned for 2022 to be a transformative year for Cyberlux community and we're seeing the growth across all of our business units, which is truly exciting. We are just really getting started. The company's operations that they're dividing, how they're getting their top priorities done, drive the growth through the aggressive business development acquisitions and joint ventures. The second one is address the core target markets in DOD, Department of Defense product and newly specialty UAS technology capabilities solar and renewables and emerging infrastructure projects and the third one is immediate solution for their business velocity by focusing on their new business and new product pipeline accelerating south american projects continuing to build companies organization and driving the ip development moving forward cyberlux corporation is harnessing future by leading the digital transformation across selected industry now if you want to take a look at how their business units are structured the first one is us solution as you see right here second one is advanced lighting solution third one is its as i just mentioned and the fourth one is SaaS. now the way they divided their revenue model for 2022 was 30.5 million which is the total as you can see which is now almost 45 million or 44.8 million and what they expected what they're expect what they were expecting in the past 15.2 mil coming from this first one flight i the second one is close to 4.7 yeah, 4.7 million from the lighting solution infrastructure its is 7.6 and says is 2.9 now we'll be able to see because this all are a massive massive business segments and they can do more or less uh, exponential growth in all four of their business units and take a look the way that they're ha handling this revenue that what they're saying is next year 2023 they're expecting close to 80 million dollars in revenue so if this year revenue is 45 million you can imagine it will be exponentially increased year over year so i wouldn't be surprised that by 2013 they say like they are a 100 million dollar revenue company or they're expecting a hundred million dollar revenue in 2023 which means at that point that profitability will spike up It'll spike through the roof as well. And what I am saying is if their market cap is 1.4 billion, which is 10x market cap, the stock can go to 2.10x. Uh, so two, 2 cents can be 20 cents by the market cap, given that there are other factors moving targets as well, if there is no stock delusion, so on and so forth. We'll see, time will say. So that's why I'm saying that do not invest your entire portfolio and I'm not a financial advisor. But what I'm saying is given that their work, they may work on their st uh, st stock restructuring, the outstanding shares, which is once again a challenge as well. And for OTC plays, there is an often challenge with the stock restructuring. And we are we are seeing for other stocks as well. Ilas has been continuously doing their share restructuring. And uh, my understanding is Cyberlux is going to look further into what they can do to improve their stocks restructure or stock structure for the benefit of their shareholders, their investors, so on and so forth. But here is what I'm trying to tell you is this business units, if all four business units do aggressively 2x it's pretty easy for the company to hit 60 million dollars revenue goal moving forward followed by 100 million and followed by 134 million as the company says here in 2024 by the way if you take a look right now we are getting a discounted price for the stock this can totally be 10x play if not 5x play if not 3x play if not 2x play so decide for yourself what you're trying to get out of it i'm just here to share this information with you hoping you can make informed financial decision one more thing i wanted to show you is the is the total volume at the moment the total volume is pretty low if you go back and see here the average volume is 105 million whereas Today's volume, as an example, is only 26 million. OTC market is sideways. The penny stocks are not doing great lately, and they are sideways as well. There are some concerns around the pandemic that is happening, the growing concerns. Second thing you want to consider is the inflation and why Cyberlux is down. Not only Cyberlux is down, the entire OTC market is down. The entire penny stocks are down. Many stocks are sideways and not doing so well. That has nothing to do with the company's fundamentals. What it has to do is with the sentiment, what can happen 
happen in future. People are fearing some lockdown impact. Now that we are a global market, anything that happens in Europe also impacts the United States, especially the stock market, especially the cryptocurrency, because it's now a global initiative and global investors participate into this type of financial vehicle so you want to be really careful and you want to make decision when the market is sideways FOMO will be there definitely when Cyberlux will go six and a half cent people will start buying and you'll see the volume goes through the roof once again but that's FOMO fear of missing out not a wise investment advice in my opinion if advisor is telling you that after the stock runs up three four five hundred percent to buy something and we saw that precisely in ILUS, ticker symbol ILUS, and I have been covering that stock on this channel as well. We made more than 12 to 15x return at one point from 4 cents to 52 cents or 2 cents. Many people, many of my invest uh, subscribers uh, bought the stock at 4, 5, 6 cents. The stock went to 51 cents. Possibly that can happen once again, deja vu with Cyberlux. I'm not saying two cents will go to one dollar. What I'm saying is this two cents can go to 20 cents, which is a 10x play. Once again, if you take a look at this chart, you will be you will be really seeing that uh, right now the RSI is 42. What suggests more or less it's a balanced situation, not an over, but not an oversold condition. Uh, I would consider that there is a slightly oversold stocks which can possibly move this stock into the positive direction in upcoming trading sessions. But if you want to take a look right here, I was suggesting that it went, I was saying actually that it went to six and a half cent back in the days. It went, it, it shows right here close to seven cents. If I move this chart a little bit, you should be able to see right here, six and a half or almost close to seven cents as you see my cursor. But then we went back down to three cents when, and then we went back up to five cents. And these were the opportunities where people can buy and turn that into swing trades and implement some of the strategies where you can write for free, which is something I love to do. And take a look at that time, you'll see when the start, stock starts moving, the FOMO kicks in, which is when you'll start seeing this green bar our juicy juicy green bar which is buying volume more and more and more when the stock goes down you'll keep seeing this red and red and red which is when you want to probably buy and i'm not a financial advisor do your research but that's where i buy mostly when i buy and then when it goes up i sell my 50 percent of my total investment which means the rest is free i ride the way for free i'm not worried about what happens because that's not my money at that point i just wanted to share this information with you hit the like button subscribe to my channel i'll see you in the next video